Hi, video three about layers of our earth. And in this video, we are gonna concentrate on the chemical layers. Chemical layers are based on the ingredients that make the layers chemically different, like ingredients in a recipe. So there are three chemical layers, the core, the mantle, and the crust. This one again is inside to outside the earth. You're gonna to wanna to create this chart, write down the material or the ingredient that each chemical layer is made out of, and any other thing that's there, what's going on, what else, where is it, what's happening. So all that info is on one big easy slide. The core, of course, very, very hot. Metal, basically iron and nickel, and a few other heavy metals. The mantle is solid, primarily, and very hot rock, um, made up of basically the mesosphere and a sphenosphere. Um, and it's a mix of metals and silicon products. And then the crust, it's the outer solid layer, it contains the continent and ocean crust, and it contains silicon or silicates and basalt rocks, um, heavier rocks. So hopefully you can get all your notes there. And then you can go by and identify the three chemical layers and what's in there, etc. But there's one fun thing to do, and that's this transition between rock and metal. Um, and that's a very famous thing called the moho or the mohorovic discontinuity. It's the boundary between the mantle and the crust in the chemical layer. And it's at this location that seismic waves begin to travel at different speeds. So they're going through the crust, basically a solid, they hit the mantle, kind of plastic-like flow, and the speed changes. And it's how we begin to determine the earth as different layers, etc. The moho, which is pretty cool, um, we'll even talk about that more in class. So I want to look at the two different types of layers, the physical layers on this half of the pie chart, that was video two, and these chemical layers where we have the core, metallic, iron, we have the mantle, iron, magnesium, silicates, and we have the thin crust, basically silicates. Three chemical layers, five physical layers, and you can see the core chemically is the same as the two cores physically. The mesosphere and basically the asthenosphere is the mantle chemically and the crust is basically part of the lithosphere so in class we're going to talk about and write on stuff and it's going to get excited remember there are five physical layers three chemical layers and you rock the world good luck fire up